I'm sure you've heard of codenames before. But this ain't the one you are familiar with. Codenames are the holding names of Windows versions, before they hit the final version. When we were making the beta for Windows 7, we accidentally called the beta files Windows 666, and you can find these 666 files in current version of Windows, if you look hard enough. It was just a normal day at the Microsoft office. Everyone was working, and doing their jobs normally. I got a strange call from an unknown number, kind of acting like someone needed help. I pick up the phone. Hello. I said in a kind polite manner. Hi there. Said the voice back. I then responded, thank you for calling Microsoft Technical Support. How can I assist you today? The voice responded, I need help with your Windows version. I then said, please specify the name of the Windows version. Is it Millennium 3.1, Windows 4 Workgroups 3.11, 95, 96, 98, and T4.0, Microsoft Chicago, Microsoft Whistler, Windows Longhorn, Windows 2000, Windows XP, Windows Me, and T5.0, etc.? The voice responded, Windows 666 I then responded, What is happening? The voice said, I'm not the problem here, it's you. The voice suddenly turned demonic and said, You're next. The phone immediately hung up. Just as I was about to leave my office for the day, all Windows computer showed a red screen of death. No, not from the PS2. It was the blue screen of death, but demonically altered. 66.6 started appearing everywhere on the Windows desktop and start menu. Then suddenly flash red and white, and for a split second I saw the number 666, no 66.6, .6, just 666. A rat attack in all computers in the vicinity of my computer were attacked by Amp Blast, and it wasn't normal. Blood red started illuminating the entire room, and into my eyes as well. I couldn't see the Amp Blast, because all the blood red was in the way. When the blood red was cleared, all computers were dead. Except for one. My computer. My office computer had stayed put. All other computers attacked by the amp blast were dead. Just as I was about to leave again the error message sound boomed from the computer. I saw the following error, file, cal.dll is corrupted and has had to be closed. All data related to file has been removed. Afterwards another message arose on the screen. I got the following error, file, resob.eggs created. Directory, not found. Another message box arose on the screen. It read, file, 666.bps created. Directory, c colon slash windows slash system 32 slash config slash system slash 666 slash 666 dot bps one final message box arose on the screen it read directory c slash windows slash system 32 slash is corrupted and has been deleted 666 dot bps file moved to desktop all other data related to directory has been removed. After that I got a Windows resolved. And when the computer rebooted, the following message arose, Windows could not start, because the following files are missing or corrupt, boot.ini, cal.dll666.bps. Please reinstall a copy of the above files. What was extremely terrifying was 666.bps was a required system directory file for my computer, even though it was created by Windows 66.6. .6. And just like that, all the computers had died. I give you one final message.